In the software, we've always had the ability to remove overlap with standard like fill and satin stitches. And in this update, I'm very excited to show you what we have now added to working with applique. We've added the ability to remove overlaps with applique, but do it intelligently so that you don't have excess bulk on the layered applique pieces. So on the screen, you will see that I have two circles here. They're different colors. They're just artwork that I'm going to select and convert each to an applique. So now I have two applique pieces. Let me go ahead and throw it in 3D view. You can see that this is the first one. This is the second one. So when it goes to stitch it out, you're going to see that it has a placement line, a tack down line, and a border. And then the second piece has the same, a placement line, a tack down, and a border. Now the issue with this design is if you stitch this out as applique and you do the first piece and then you go and you lay the second piece down what's going to happen is this satin stitch right here is going to kind of show through it's going to like push the fabric up and you don't want that look with the applique so what we've done is we've made it an option to where you can select these right mouse click so selecting two applique pieces right mouse clicking and I'm going to choose the option for remove overlaps. When I do that, you'll notice that the design changes. So if I zoom back in to this, you'll see that now you don't see that border underneath, but it's done more than just that. So let me go ahead and show you with a slow redraw what's happening here. So when I do a slow redraw, you'll see that I have a placement stitch and notice that because I removed the overlaps, it kind of looks like a kind of a Pac-Man right now but you can see that it did modify that design. So there's a placement in the tack down, but what's really neat is what happens with the border stitch. So you'll see that it's gonna do this satin border, but it's gonna stop right there. So it's not going to actually stitch the border pieces because we are already gonna have it with the second object and we don't want that excess bulk. So when I show you the next object, you'll see that it's a it does the placement and then the tack down line and then it does the border and this is just a really neat uh, feature that we've added the software um, it's very intelligent in how it is able to punch a design through another remove the overlaps and at the same time remove the border stitch from underneath the um, object that stitches second so that you don't get excess bulk at all with your applique design. So this is a really neat feature. We hope that you enjoy it. Hope that you use it.